My respect, Dr. Meng Li Jiegui, Founder, Chairman and CEO, Mr. President, Campus Directors, Senior Management, General Committees, Teachers, Staff, Parents and my fellow graduates. Good morning. I'm Sandy Sim. Today, I'm honored to be standing here and give this graduation speech as a representative of Level 12 students. Congratulations to the class of 2019. We've made it. Please, everyone, give yourself a big round of applause. <laughs> Standing here in front of hundreds of people reminded me when I first joined AII in 2015. After joining AII, I've changed a lot. I've changed from a girl who was reserved and hated to talk to everyone to a girl who has enough confidence to deliver speech on stage in front of hundreds of people. Because of AII, I become another person whom I never thought I would be. I become the champion in contests, I've changed to be an assertive person, and I've become more mature. Coming to this far, we all here have experienced all kinds of precious moments. There's a time when you and your friend did something wrong, and we're called to meet headachers whose face look fiercer than tiger. You know, some of those guys in the front. And there's also so time when you are happy, making fun of your teacher, editing his picture, or pranking him about his hilarious videos, even though it's not ever a full day. But eventually, you feel kind of frustrated when you found out that he's not going to teach you again next term. And when all of those homeworks, quizzes, projects, all comes at the same time, and it's like, ugh, I cannot take it anymore. However, there's also another time in school, which to me, consider us the most painful time, which is when we fail contest. Especially when you try so hard, you prepare so much, and you tell yourself that I can make it, but then you still fail. I experienced that most of the time, but what I told myself is that I must not give up. And finally, I won the World Speed Contest. <laughs> but for those of you who haven't achieved your goal yet, please don't give up. I spent two years to train myself to be the champion. During those two years, I failed a lot. But what you have to do is to be not afraid of failure. You fail because you made the mistake. But why not take those mistakes as a lesson learned? Like the book titled, Dr. Ming Lee, Coffee and Me. Here's the book. If you haven't read it yet, it is available in the bookstore. <laughs> you know, in this book, he states that his mistake is for a change, for a better future. So, do you agree with him? Of course, without those mistakes, you won't be who you are today. Mistake shows that you are trying. Just make sure that you will not make the same mistake again next time. Personally, I can say that I have gone through a tough journey at AI. A journey which trained me to be the best. A journey to help me overcome my failure. A journey to allow me to unlock my potential. And a journey for me to involve in society through some charity events. But no matter what, we all here have gone through all of those journeys and obstacles. So today is the day we celebrate our success. <laughs> Finally, I would like to take this great opportunity to thanks to my parents, especially my demanding daddies for always demanding me to be the top student in class. Thanks to my family for the unconditional love and support. Thank you, teachers, for making this day happen for everyone. Thanks to all of my friends for staying by my side through all the hardship we met. Finally, Thanks, Dr. Ming Lee, for establishing this great educational system. I wish you, your family, and especially your MTFUE family all the best. <laughs> Last but not least, before I end my speech, there's a food for thought. Never give up on something you really want. I know it's difficult to wait, but it's even worse to regret. Also, read as much as you can. The more you read, the more you know. Maybe someday you read a book and it will change your whole entire life. Thanks everyone for your kind attention and your precious time. Once again, congratulations everyone and please enjoy this day. Thank you. Respected Dr. Meng Lee Jae Mr. President, Campus Directors, Senior Management, General Committee, Heads, Deputy Heads, Teachers, Staff and Parents. 
A very pleasant Saturday morning to everyone, especially to our beloved graduates. Being today's kid program representative and standing on this stage makes me feel so joyful. My name is Connie Ta Hao. I am 13 years old, and I would like to congratulate you all who have worked very hard to achieve today's goal. Now, I acknowledge the fact that everyone is very excited to finish their programs and receive their well-deserved certificates. Well, so am I. But taking this spectacular opportunity, I would like to share some of my experiences at AI. I have studied at AI since 2015, and I can tell you that every single day I spent at AI is different. The first time that I stepped into AI, it felt like I was in a whole different universe. Lessons were never boring, classes were always packed with laughters, and teachers just have a special element inside them that attracts us to study. At that time, my English skills weren't very good, but I believe my speaking skills have improved a lot now. Not only my speaking skills, but also my reading and writing skills. And it wasn't just me who have worked hard for these improvements. It is also because of the teachers at AI. They take their time, to teach and nourish their students. They share all the knowledge they have without hesitating, and they've taught me through every single obstacle I've overcome. It just fascinates me at how hard they've worked. Not only that, AI also share great experiences to their students so that the sprouts we are now will bloom and blossom into vibrant flowers in the future. Now, I know, it wasn't easy to make your way through this journey. We've all had our ups, and downs. But with the help of teachers and friends, they've taught me that nothing is impossible. The bigger your dream and your determination is, the brighter your future will be. They have taught me with their unconditional love and care that the patience inside you is the key to your dreams. It goes without saying that the best preparation for tomorrow is doing your best for today. This is equivalent to saying that time does not wait for you. Every single hour, minute, and second counts. So what you plan to do today, do it wisely and put all your hard work into it so that you can take the mistakes and experiences of today to change and make a better tomorrow. In order to make a better tomorrow, you also have to dream big. Don't be hesitant. Believe you can do it. Don't be apprehensive. You either get it or you lose it. Dreaming big, doing your best, Working hard till your last drop of blood, sweat, and tears will make your future shine brighter than you've ever imagined. So don't be afraid to aim big, try hard, and don't ever think about giving up. Because we all can do this together. Last but not least, I would like to say thank you to my friends for always being there for me whenever I was going through hardships. They make things seem a lot easier. Thank you to my teachers for helping me with everything I've been through. If it wasn't for you guys, I don't think we'd be able to stand here today. Thank you to my parents for giving me the best opportunity and that is studying at AI. Thank you to Dr. Ming Lee for creating such a beautiful education system. And thank you to everyone for being my star in this dark night sky. Thank you for lighting the way for me. The laughters and cries we shared, I will always cherish. And now, let's keep on shining for each other, shall we? Now, it's time to end the first chapter of our book and open many more brighter ones together in the future. Again, I would like to congratulate you all with another big round of applause. You have worked very hard and been very strong. We are indeed very proud of you all. And this is the end. Thank you. Thank you very much, Kanita.